Hello everyone, it's Trap Legend here, and today I'm going to be finishing up Withering Waves with doing the tier 6 of each hologram plus. Now, at the time of recording this, I have already done the most difficult one, which is the Tempest Memphis. Uh, I'm gonna basically edit that to the end of the video. I wanted to make sure I can beat this, because I think I can beat every single one if I can do that. Not easily, obviously, but like it's possible with my damage amount to do it. So yeah, we're gonna be starting with the impermanent Ciron, or what I like to call him, the big bird. This should be the easiest. Oh, and obviously no longer am I running the Jixia Tauji Verina. I'm now running Jixia Changli Verina. Tauji has kind of been benched. I might use her in third team, but yeah. Changli is just very, very good. Uh, I think both Changli and Tauji have like the best in slot buffs for Chixia, but Changli is just overall quite a bit better. So yeah. Let's start Never with passed. the impermanent Heron, I guess. Um, and let's hope we can do it first try. Alright, it's time for attempt number 5. I've lost quite a few times to attacks that basically uh, I don't know how to dodge, simply because of... Uh, well, you cannot dodge them, you have to actually move out of the way but he moves faster than you. So I think I'm supposed to have some kind of... Well, even the model by Gecko has so much build up and it can't be done in time. So I'm pretty unsure of what to do, but hey, it is what it is. We ball. This boss has not as much health, so I can actually just probably do attempts while not being able to dodge the attack and win. We'll see, we'll see. Mine Ow. Ow. Well, that's a bad thing. Yeah. So yeah, those feather things that fall, I thought that was like... I think that was in tier 5 actually. But I didn't remember it, and those are actually pretty hard. Because again, it's one of those attacks you cannot dodge, you have to actually move out of the way. These ones. So I've been moving out of the way as I know that these attacks will plant them soon. So I don't do that. Mess up. I feel like dodging that back so it's good. Because I have to dodge very well. Okay, there's feathers again. No, there's not. We can move them. Oh, right, he, that attack might be. Yeah, this is my favorite attack when he just blocks and tries to regain his power. Because that's just, hey. Damage me, I'm here, damage me. Like, it's nice. Okay, I can probably do this. Yeah. Come on, do the blocking attack. No? Maybe has a cooldown moment. My jangly build, I'll probably show it after. I actually show it after this boss. But uh, it's not actually that good. I have like level 4 talents and stuff. We're just doing pretty good damage considering that. Ooh, you're about to get shot. You didn't read it. Ah, wow, wow, wow. You're taking more? Okay. It's fine, I guess. So I do have that bird here. Okay, this, like this attack, I don't know how to dodge. Right, you just have to run away while he's directly on you, flying faster than you. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe there's some method, maybe you have to hit him before he does that or something, but I don't know. Really uh, how do I not die from that? Because those are eager as well. Let's get this. Oh, okay, I dodged too early. Oh, okay, I can leave that. Okay, that's fine. Um, I thought there was a very different attack. Here. Yeah, spawn feathers. Well, I'm not even okay, like this. What do I do? Can I just move like Verena? Okay, Verena's dash seems to be good at dodging. Yeah. I don't think that's the intended method, but it's fine. Get that, get this. Let's try to get a swap in resonance liberation. There we go, we get a parry. That parry did not help your continuing your attack. I hate parries that don't actually do anything. And I... There we go. You die now. Well, you don't, but you take a lot of damage. 
52,000. That's great. I didn't even flash. Oh, that's bad. Okay, I gotta. Let's do this. Okay, we break, and this is it. Um, took pretty long, to be fair. I didn't have to do that and turn anything, but still. I'd say this was a pretty considerable move. I'm out of time for this, but I do think the big bird is tankier than some other enemies. Like, the morning ikes, I assume. I think that might be it, honestly. There we go, my mini skill reward, but it is done. Uh, so let me show the builds real quick uh, before I move on to the next one. Static mist, um, please. Max uh, talents for level 80 and C6. Shang Li, level 7 weapon. Um, these, I will say, this one was way worse for the Thundering Memphis. I mean, the Tempest Memphis, so, you know. Technically, I'm less stuff on that. I could actually buy these upgrades, but I'm not gonna unless I need to because I just did just uh, do the hardest one without it. So it'll be fine. And obviously here I have uh, well actually let's move back to the turtle for the other bosses. I actually do want to use the bird for Cranless though. Very low stuff E1 actually. Uh, because I don't think I need to upgrade the healer much. Anyway next up the next easiest one I guess is the monkey. Yeah. So five attempts for impermanence here on. Uh, let's move on to the Make big monkey. Fast. Hopefully we'll beat this first try, cope, but yeah. It is time for attempt number 7, this boss has gotten, like I've been almost there with one minute left and died. Uh, I think each attempt, <laughs> even the first attempt where I didn't know he spawns these hologram monkeys like that. And why? It's the, like he deals DOT damage. Okay, just died. I guess we can reset that one to go attempt number 8. But, um, yeah, he deals damage over time. As you can see, look at my health. That is so unfair. I don't know, like, why they decided, hey, let's make a boss deal DLT damage. Where you cannot actually avoid the damage other than just never getting hit at all. Which, I'm gonna be honest, I, like, I get it. But just kill me in one hit instead of applying DLT right after. Like, that feels like you're just saying, hey... We didn't dodge this attack, have two characters die. It's really annoying. The monkeys themselves are actually pretty fun to dodge. I didn't know they actually appeared. Well, I know like of their existence, but I didn't know how they work because I hadn't fought this boss before. And they're pretty cool. Basically, after each series of attacks, it will spawn monkeys. And the monkeys will do funny stuff when you dodge them. <laughs> Who's the now? Ow, I brought a monkey. Let's revive. That actually do have some liberation. Because we don't need buffs at all times, right? Monkey maybe? No, it's this one then. After he's broken, he will go on the pillar, which is like fine. But after that, he will spawn a lot of monkeys, and they're very hard to dodge. There we go. He stays on the ground for so long, though. It's fine. Let's prepare for uh, this. I'm actually not to use the camera on this guy. I feel like I'm just better looking around. Okay, so now I think there's a lot of here. So. Okay, so you can dodge them like by just starting to dodge uh, as it happens. You have to actually like, I think, time everyone, which is terrible. Like, that's probably one of the hardest attacks in holograms, I think. Or maybe I'm just like bad. I guess if I were used to it, it would be easier. 
No monkey. Fucking monkey. But like... Again, like I'm doing good right now, but I feel like I'm just gonna die at the end like each one of the other attempts. Okay, I don't know why Chang is slow to time for it. He throws me out sometimes. Okay, like, what was that? Like, time just slowed down and it took time... Like, I could dodge there. Well, I could dodge there, but he was had stopped moving, so I missed the time. It hasn't happened since I used Changli's, but I did just have it happen with Chixia, yes, so I'm not sure. I think it's something related to Changli anyway, but... Yeah. Sucks to suck, I guess. Oh, monkey. Scary monkey. Okay. Monkey! Go. Get the stacks there, let's get back to healing up. Can you just come here? Monkey coming in. Yeah. I guess spinning attack while I'm close to him is scary. We'll get them. Yep, let's just uh... How much time do we have left? Yeah, we should be fine, unless we just die. Which is very likely. Oh, that was the slow attack. Monkey! I dodged way too early, but it didn't matter, because I wasn't in the range anymore. Just walked away. Get this. Oh, there's a monkey there. Dodge that. Good, good. Yeah, this should be... Well, I'm not gonna say anything. I've died at one minute left. Each one of these attempts, I swear to God. Well, I actually don't swear to God, because some of them failed right at the start. Like, most of them anyway. Okay, we're getting some really good damage from Chen. There we go. Yeah. I don't do anything funky right now. I mean, there will be the hard attack after this one. And I will probably lose a character. So I just swap to Verena. So if I do lose someone, it's gonna be Verena. I don't need Verena at the end of the fight anymore. Leave it to me. Luminous energy. I dodge. Okay, I'm not dodging. Okay, we're still fine. Uh, I could learn how to dodge that attack, but I'm like I deal so much damage, and I have like I'm doing so many attempts that I feel like I don't actually need to. I just die. Thank you. Okay, that is the monkey done in I think eight attempts. This was wow. That was significantly harder than I thought it would be, but there it is. Actually, one second extra compared to how much my Tempest Memphis did take in the actual run itself that I won. Obviously, in terms of attempts, that was a lot easier, but yeah. Let's just heal up, and we're gonna go into Morning Ikes here. Morning Ikes is gonna be something for sure. If it doesn't have anything new at tier 6, I think it should be fine. It is still a hard boss, but the only like good thing about it is the fact that he has like no health. Just die. Take four. Okay, so I'll see you at the winning attempt, I guess, of Morning Alex, which is gonna be the first one. Let's go. All right, welcome to attempt number twelve. Uh, being very hard, uh, this boss dies quite quickly, so that's not the problem. The only problem with this boss is just the fact that it's hard. I feel like Morning Ikes has even harder to dodge attacks than the Thunder in Memphis. The only like good thing being is basically his health is way way lower. So it's not a race against health and the boss like Thunder Memphis, it's just a race to not die basically. Like as you can see the damage numbers are already pretty insane. And I somehow died already. There we go. That was a clear dodge, I'm just saying. Okay. We have no chicks here. We have no chicks Beckon the divine flame. It's fine. We can just carry with Chinese. Very nice 
right there. That bell saved me right there. Oh, why was that so delayed? Okay, I'm actually parried them. Let's go. Now you're stunned, you know, which is going to deal a lot of damage here, basically. To get, you know... As much damage as we can while he's just sleeping here. Okay, halfway through. Pretty good. Even more than halfway through. We're just trying this one. Okay, so he does a scream here. That does actually stun you, I think. Like you cannot move the world. You're doing a lot of like low range attacks. Oh god. Very good. Okay, we can do this here. I know what you're doing. I should have done that a little bit later to come. I think you're doing a hard attack now. I cannot move. I can move. Now. Let's focus. Let's focus. I know what you're doing right now. And I just first touch it. I'm very just dead. Okay. Going pretty bad for the end here. Why are you up in the air, Jenny? Please stop. No, this hard is happening. We're dead. No, we're not. Yeah, I got stuck in the actual boss there, so I didn't dodge as well. If I get hit once, I die right now because I don't have anyone to swap to, basically. So it's always good. Okay, good, good. Is attack good? You know what? We're not gonna revive anymore. You can die. There we go. I didn't make it last shot off. That is the morning ice, I think, 11 attempts here. Um, still took less time than the monkey, simply because that boss is way faster. Surprised it even took 4 minutes. Okay. Now it is time for the latest hologram, the hardest hologram. Well, I don't think it's the hardest hologram. I think the Tempest Memphis is harder, but Groanless, oh boy. For Chixia, yeah, this is bad because I think this boss very much focuses on parries. And you know, Chixia yeah, cannot parry, <laughs> so we're gonna have to probably rely on uh, Changli here. Before Changli was released. I did do difficulty 5 with Ling Yang Chixia, which is two main DPSs again, which is pretty funny. Well, we'll see at the winning attempt, <laughs> if I win. Alright, welcome to attempt number 6. This boss is hard. Um, I've been trying to get used to the dodge things. I will say, I think Xiang Li is one of the, like a part of the problem, simply because of the fact that she has so many particle effects and her an animations take like some time, so like, I need to actually use her at, like attacks at very 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 certain times to actually get off the, uh, get off the dodges, otherwise it's just like, I do an animation, try to dodge as he's attacking because he attacks so fast and it doesn't work, and I fail miserably and my life is over. Like there, like that attack, I couldn't have dodged. Like I couldn't have predicted that he would have thrown that attack. So it does make Changli feel a little bad. But it is what it is. It is the phase one mostly. 
Well, obviously it's in the other phases too, but it's that one most easy. You do actually want to heal. It's pretty hard to heal on this castle. Let me use an ultimate here. There's another ultimate here. Dodge fast. Yeah. At least that's like a predictable set of moves there. I should definitely use food items here. Okay, so this starting attack, like this transformation attack, I guess not starting attack, is very, very hard to get. And I, I don't think I've gotten it off once. Like, as a perfect dodge. But it's fine if I do swarm like that, right? <laughs> Is that the same attack? Make it feels fast. like the same attack. What? I just dodged there, but it didn't go. Oh, and you just hit me with something? Well, that sucks. That's actually not stop the recording and move on to the next attempt, which I think is... 7 maybe? And we're actually gonna bring in the food items. Uh, we'll use this if it's like low. Otherwise I think it's just that. Yeah. That's actually pretty good, yeah. I guess we can use that enough if we need extra health. Oh, why is the wrong ability? I should build some ult here. Let's swap. Alright. Okay, my dodge is not happening. I guess after some basic attacks, you can immediately dodge. I also don't like why the lock on like keeps him a little bit on the left. It's a bit annoying. Like I'd like them to be straight in front of me. Especially because you're they are like way bigger. So I just don't see them. You can actually stay over there and just get him to hit you. Like, I mean, not hit you as you hit him ranged. Like, I think forever. But the damage is so low that at the time, once you're finished, it's actually pretty scary to like, actually fight against the team. But yeah, I guess you just didn't fall off. I don't really know how to dodge this attack well. Maybe I'm just mid-air. It will work. Ow. Okay, we survived at least. Even though we didn't do the dodge. Okay, we're almost dead already. Oh, it's this attack that I was supposed to block with the bird. Okay, are we good? We're not good because we needed two dodges for that one. Let's just use, use this immediately in your face. This guy is tanky, even though it's like a fair tank. Together we watch. Beckon the divine flame. Sever! Uh, I should be parrying more. There we go. Okay, you're stunned. Let's give you a little bit of a gunshot. Gunshot. I was gonna say gunfire, I said gunshot just three times trying to correct myself. I think I might be going insane in this boss fight. Come here. Okay, do that. No, no. Okay. I really know I was about to do something stupid there. Why 
need to stop time. Oh, I hear lightning outside. Hopefully, I don't have to stop gaming. Okay, ultimate here. Okay, okay. We're actually gonna go here, we're gonna go back, back, and we're gonna get the fusion damage bonus just like I used to in Thunder Memphis. Just in case, you know. Oh, that was a Okay. I don't have enough stamina for anything right now, but I have enough stamina to do that, which is simply just, you know. <laughs> using that one skill though. I do think that bird makes this a lot easier because that attack is very good. Ow, oh, I would have died there if I didn't. Okay, well, I died there even if I didn't. Okay. I recouped that. Oh. Okay, parry. We can actually revive here. Together we vanish. Okay, Shang Li's just dead again. Man, this sucks. I feel like I'm so close, but I'm so far. I don't think this is gonna be t the attempt on me. Let me try to heal. Use the liberation here. I'm taking so much damage, but you have so much. Strikes. Okay, this was somewhat easy to dodge. As I say that, I miss. But you somehow didn't one shot me. I guess your damage is not decreased. Oh, please, 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 please. Yes. Do that. Do you have enough for a while? I only have 30 seconds left. 18. Lightning outside. Okay, you keep doing that over there, and I keep doing my thing over here. I think this is it. No! No, 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 no. Okay, we revive chicks here. We dodge. You have 24 seconds left. Like, please, man. Shoot him! Shoot him, Jixia! Kill him! <laughs> Let's go! And that is technically the last one. Uh, obviously, the clip of the last one will come now. Oh, that was hard. That didn't take as long as the other ones, but that somehow felt more frustrating. And I think it's because that's the hardest one. But I, like, that's the one I... That's the latest one I did. So I, like, had some sense of what to do. Damn, well that's it, um, before we leave, I guess I did show my setup before, um, like after killing the bird, so if you didn't see that and you want to see the setups I have, go there, right after the bird was killed, so the first hologram, and yeah, I guess we're gonna be moving on to the Tempest Memphis, the last one which I recorded yesterday. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. This might be the, uh, this is technically the end of Withering Waves, which is pretty funny. Obviously I haven't done the tower completely, but that's more like a damage check. Well, that's 100% a damage check, not a skill check. Whereas those are like damage and skill checks, so yeah. Thanks for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one. The investment fish roll out. Make it fast. Beckon the divine flame.
Together we vanish. Perish in flames. Be reduced to cinders. My blade gain. Divine flame. Make it for seven. We vanish. Mind on. <laughs> Who's the caged bird now? That's it, that's it, that's it, let's go! Okay, this is actually, by the way, as I'm recording this, I'm shaking. Um, this is actually the last, I mean the first one that I did. I've been doing this for a pretty long time. Um, so when the video does come up, uh, these will be put in front of it, which I haven't done any on the difficulty 6. But I just wanted to make sure I can beat the, the hardest boss in the game, so like these wouldn't be as hard, and it's done. <sighs> oh my... Damn. Would I have a... I don't think I would have had enough damage if I didn't pop this mid-battle. Because I was like, okay, this seems pretty good, let me eat this, drink this. There it is. Changli, Verena and Chixia. 
Tempest, Memphis 6 and all the other holograms. To be fair, I haven't done them at this time, but this will be at the end of the video. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.